We're here today at the site of a large waste fire on the Westwood Industrial Estate Enterprise Way in Margate. Our message to the public from the Fire and Rescue Service and from all the agencies that have been working here is one of thanks. Uh, we've been here for just over a week now, about mid-September when we actually got the call to here and uh, there's been a lot of work that's been going on, not just from firefighters but from lots of other agencies. The incident now, as you can see behind me, is still ongoing and it will be ongoing for possibly about another three weeks. We're doing as much as we can on site to put this fire out as quickly as possible, but there will still be smoke for the next couple of weeks that's going to be coming away from this site. There's about 16,000 bales of waste that was stored within this particular site. All of that needs to be turned over and pulled out of this building and that's going to can take a considerable time. Waste has been wrapped in a plastic, uh, plastic coating the problem that we've had on site here is that obviously in the early stages of the fire that plastic coating has just melted so all of the waste has then just come into one huge lump if you like on the site for us to have to deal with. The waste is, is a mixture of everything, I think there's probably everything that you can imagine that would be in there from paper to plastics, uh, everything. We're working with the environment agency here on site to make sure we recycle the water so that's a big thing there so that actually we, we're looking to minimise any environmental damage that could come from this as well. In the early stages of the fire here we was probably up to around 15 or 18 fire engines that we had here with all of the different support appliances that we had. We're now down to about three fire engines during the day so we're really offensively working with the contractors to turn over all the waste and in the evening we've got what we would call a watching brief here because obviously every now and again pockets of fire do come back up within the, the, the pile of, of rubbish there and so teams on site can actually extinguish that also through the night what we're doing is re recycling the water as well. So crews are engaged then in pumping the water that has been used from around the site back into the large dams that you'll see that the Environment Agency have provided around the site. So that way we can capture the water, we're using less water and also we're reducing any contaminated water that goes into the water course. That We will probably be here for about the next th uh, three weeks. Uh, what we would expect is that the, the smoke at times will reduce but as you can see from behind me, it only takes the, the contractors to start moving the waste pile about for some fires to reignite and obviously then you'll get some more smoke. So really the public can expect there to be smoke for about the next three weeks. We're trying to manage it and do as much as we can for businesses and people to get back to, to life as normal. Clearly people will have uh, concerns about the, the smoke in the area. The main thing we would say is Public Health England are the key agency for you to speak to around that. You can get a lot of information from their website. You can also get links from our website to the different information that's coming on at this moment in time. The main thing to do is, if you are concerned, is to obviously close your windows and your doors if you've got them open to limit the amount of smoke that, that can come into your home, into your office. We'd really like to give out a big, huge thanks to everybody that's been in and around this particular fire here in Margate. That's from the businesses that are alongside that have been very considerate in the way that we've had to bring all our resources in and trying to actually carry on their, their operations when the smoke's in the air here. Right the way down to the families, the schools, the hospitals and everybody in the local community. Everybody's been fantastic in the support they've given us. What we, we would say is please just stay with us. We will be here for about the next three weeks. There will still be some smoke in the area but we're doing all we can to extinguish this fire. It's a very complex operation and there is a huge amount of rubbish and waste here that needs to be turned over and fully extinguished before we can leave the site.